Steve Shea for the Affiliated Steam and Hot Water, and today I'm going to show you how to repair an ASCO solenoid valve. This is beneficial to learn how to rebuild so you can do it in the field, uh, it saves time and money, and uh, it's pretty simple. Um, so let's get going. First step, we take off the retaining cap and the clip. Got to be careful with this. Uh, a lot of times it slips off and it cuts your finger, so you got to be very careful. And you take off the solenoid, and that's the end of step one. Step two, we have to unscrew the screws. Obviously, I made this, uh, took it apart beforehand, so it's a lot easier than it is in the field. Got to be careful. If you take this apart, sometimes the spring comes shooting out at you. So it's got to be hold on to it. Simply take it apart. That's all the internals, the ASCO solenoid valve. That's the end of step two. So step three, take apart the gaskets, put the new ones back in. Obviously you want to make sure it is clean before you put any new parts back in. We want to reassemble the diaphragm. Put it back on top. And screw the screws back in. Step four, you want to unscrew the stem because there is a gasket inside of there you want to replace. Simply just put the gasket back in there and screw it back down. Put the solenoid valve back on, retaining clip cap, and you're all set. Thank you for watching this video on rebuilding an ASCO solenoid valve, and if you want to watch more videos or tutorials, please go to affiliatedsteam.com.